<laughs> all right, I've never done this before. I don't feel like I'm really ready, but you all were asking for it, so I'll give it to you. Amen. Um, right. Amen. Um, if I don't talk loud enough or if I say anything that's misguided or out of context, you let me know. That's good. Amen. Let's open with a prayer. Thank you, God, for this opportunity to speak your words tonight. Please be with me. Keep me on track. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Let's have a look at Proverbs 14, verse 12. Proverbs 14, There is a way which seemeth right unto a man, but the end thereof are the ways of death. That's good. If one time isn't enough for you, go ahead two chapters, Proverbs 16, verse 25. There is a way that seemeth right unto a man, but the end thereof are the ways of death. Amen. So good. the right and wrong of man is pretty different than the right and wrong of God. Right. It's good. It's right. I've seen people try to project worldly right and wrong on salvation, and it doesn't work. That's right. It's good. In the short amount of time that I've been saved, I've been in silent partner soul winning with you all and talking to my family and stuff. I've noticed people have a hard time accepting that a saved person will still enter heaven if they do something really bad, like murder. Yep. They don't like eternal security. Right. Yep. They do like to think they're better than a murderer. They deserve heaven because of something they've done or haven't done. That's good. Where do people get this idea? That's Anywhere good. you look besides the Bible, you'll find this idea. That's right. Ultimately, ultimately, must be from the devil. That's, That's right. right. Amen. We have a manual for salvation straight from God here, but Amen. nobody ever wants to read the manual. Amen. That's right. That's good. That's good. I might not get this emotional, but it does anger me that yeah. uh, some people at least have this great thirst for knowledge and they'll look everywhere for answers except for one place that actually has the answers. That's, That's it. it. Amen. According to the world, uh, stealing is wrong, condoms are okay, cocaine is wrong, beer is okay, prayer in school is wrong, Come on. sexuality Come on. is okay. That's good. Come on. And uh, I don't really like to use the word retarded in this context, but I thought about it. There's no more accurate way to describe this last idea in my list here. It just... Um, the most obviously hypocritical idea I've ever heard in my life. Murder is wrong, abortion is okay. That's right. Come on. Come on. The same Come on. thing. That's, that's right. Amen. Right. That's good. That's good. Anyway, that's what the world says, and it all seems pretty arbitrary to me. Right. It's good. In uh, Matthew 15, 9, Jesus says, But in vain they do worship me, teaching for doctrines the commandments of men. Good. That's right. And, uh, yeah, two more verses here. Okay. Isaiah 59, 10, We grope for the wall like the blind, and we grope as if we had no eyes. We stumble at noon days in the night. We are in desolate places as dead men. And Romans 12, 2. And be not conformed to this world, but be transformed good. by the renewing of That's your good. mind, That's good. Amen. that you may prove what is a good and acceptable and perfect will of God. Amen. If you want to stop groping like a blind man, if you want to know real right from wrong, stop watching Oprah and Ellen DeGeneres. Come on, it's good. Come on. Amen. Amen. Read the Bible. Amen. 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 Stop paying Amen. so much attention to man's law. Read God's law. Amen. 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 Stop good. listening to your Catholic preacher and read Come on. the Bible. That's good. Good. Amen. The Bible will tell you the only difference between those that are going to heaven and those that are going to hell is what they believe. Right. They right. Do. Amen. John 3.18. Amen. It's good, Scott. He that believeth on him is not condemned, but he that believeth not is condemned already, because he has not believed in the name of the only begotten Son of God. Amen. What is this verse talking about? Who's condemned? Who's not? Who's going to heaven? Who's going to hell? Did it say anything at all about good and bad? Come on. It's good. Did it even mention sin? Come on. It's good. It's good. Amen. Who's not condemned? He that believeth on him. Right. Who's not con Amen. Who is condemned? He that believeth not. That's, That's right. That's the only Amen. difference. I'm not saying there's no difference in the severity of sin. Some of them are worse than others. Like right. one other it's good. It's good. Right. It's I'm only talking about as far as salvation goes, getting to heaven. It's Amen. Good. Amen. It's good. Uh, Romans chapter 3 expands on this idea of not working your way to heaven. Let's have a look at that. Romans 3, Romans chapter 19. Now we know that what things soever the law saith, that saith to them who are under the law, that every mouth may be stopped, and all the world may become guilty before God. Therefore, by the deeds of the law, there shall no flesh be justified in his sight. Amen. That's right. For by the law is the knowledge of sin. But now the righteousness of God without the law is manifested, being witnessed by the law and the prophets. Even the righteousness of God, which is by works? Not 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 no. Faith of Jesus Amen. Christ. Amen. Amen. Right. Right. To all and upon all them that believe, for there Amen. is no difference. Right. For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. God. 
being justified freely by his Amen. grace through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus, whom God has set forth to be a propitiation through faith in his blood, Amen. to declare his righteousness for the remission of sins that are past. Amen. What about sins of the future? It's good. Come on. Come on. It's good. Seriously, you put it with I'm, I'm asking. No. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't read that much. How do we know he's paid for our sins of the future, too? Tell me. Who knows? Romans 4. Romans 4. All right, look that one up. He will not impute sin, justified from all things. Excellent. Through the forbearance of God, to declare, I say, at this time, his righteousness, that he might be just and the justifier of him which believeth in Jesus. Where is boasting then? It is excluded by what law? Of works? Nay, but by the law of faith. Amen. Therefore, we conclude that a man is justified by faith without the deeds of the law. Yeah. And that's talking about in the sight of God, not like things too. Right, right, right. Yeah. Um, Acts 13, 40. What are we looking at? Where it says. Acts 13, 40, 39. Acts 13, 39. Yeah. And by him all that believe are justified from all things, right. from which you cannot be justified good. by the law of Moses. Amen. That's good. Right there. Right. Good. So, uh, if we're not justified by works, as for a work salvation preacher, how many works do you have to do to get to heaven? Good. So how good do you have to be to get to heaven? It's good. Good. What sounds bad enough to keep you out of heaven? Is it one lie, several lies, some specific number of lies, adultery, murder? What's the cutoff point? Yeah. I asked some Catholic guy this the first time Richie ever took me out to soul winning. He didn't know, of course. <laughs> <laughs> what do I say the cutoff point is? It's Revelation chapter 20, I think it is, unless who's going to hell and who's not getting into heaven. It's zero sin, absolutely none. That's, that's right. right. Amen. Amen. Yeah, it's good. The only person that's ever been above that threshold is Jesus Christ. Right? Amen. It's good. No matter how hard you try, no matter how good the world says you are, whether you like it or not, we've all fallen short. That's right. Good. Amen. As far as getting to heaven goes, there's no difference between you and a murderer. Right. If you're right. a murderer right. watching this, as far as getting to heaven, there's no difference between you and a liar. That's good. Right. Amen. He that believeth on him, not condemned. That's he right. that believeth not, condemned. Just right. that simple. That's good. That's right. That's good. I'd like to close with Acts 16.30, which I'm sure you all know very well. Sirs, what must I do to be saved? And they said, Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, Amen. and thou shalt be saved That's good. in thy house. Amen. Amen. Pray with me. Thank you, God, for giving me the strength and confidence to preach your word tonight. May it open the eyes of those who hear it. And thank you for our fellowship here tonight. May we all learn something from each other and grow as Christians. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. amen.